hi everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome back to some more stray kids and i'm finally here to sit and listen to a couple of new releases we've had from the kids over the last week or so and today i am starting off with sungmin's um song phobia which is an ost i believe i am not 100 percent clued up on this i'm not sure if it's from a webtoon or an anime i'm not 100% sure but all I know is that Sungmin has done the track and we all know that when it comes to OSTs Sungmin always nails it he always knocks it out of the park and yeah I just can't wait to kind of hear what this is the vibe the you know the lyrics etc etc if you can educate me as to what this is for I'd love to know because I am a big like anime and manga fan so I'd love to kind of know what the story is and, and where this came from that's re that'd be really interesting to me but either way I want to know if it's a ballad or if it's like an opener kind of anime track if, if that's the case then they're normally a little bit more out there than like the um the closing songs of an anime if that makes sense or a webtoon I don't know how what it's for but but that's normally the kind of route that it goes um but either way I'm super excited um at first I when I saw phobia I was like oh my god is that the skiz song phobia is it being used for an ost um but no it's actually a completely different song um because phobia is queen everyone phobia is queen as in the skiz song phobia is one of the best um but yeah anyway there's no music video it's literally just going to be the lyrics that I've got here because I genuinely just want to like know the message and what he's singing to me etc etc i'm assuming it's in korean i assume um just because i know that you know they have done osts in japanese as well as a group so yeah not sure um but either way super excited so with that being said guys what do i always say get a snack get a drink make sure you're comfortable let's go Okay, everyone, are we ready? Are we comfortable? So this is the official audio of the new song Phobia. Um, for like I say, is the is the is it called Phobia? Is that what the um anime or webtoons called, or is that just the name of the song? Again, probably should have read this or read up about it before I came to this, but I was just too excited to hear the song. But it is Sungmin from Stray Kids, so very excited. With that being said and done, are we ready? Three, two, one, press play. Boop. Okay, bit of a rock vibe going on. I wish, wish there was visuals. to pause i'll take it back slightly i don't know how to explain it but for some reason and i said something similar similarly was that a word similarly when i heard lino's um day six cover i just feel like their voices are maturing really really well like we already know that they already have this talent we already know that their voices are absolutely stunning but when when i say maturing i mean that in like a good way like sungmin seems to be changing things around a bit he sounds so just grown up it's similar with jisung as well jisung's been doing it a lot where they they already have hit this talent level so it's like instead of pushing their boundaries and kind of trying to i don't know change who they are as vocalists they just sound to be maturing their voices and just making it just sound i can't i, can't, I you know me i'm rubbish at putting things into words but i just it sounds it sounds like Sungmin, but just on a different level. Like there's something about his voice here that just sounds so much more grown up, so much more mature. He sounds so 
well, it sounds so good, you know, obviously, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it's like I say with Jason where they're doing slightly different alterations to their voices. I don't know what it is, but I love it. Like, I love it so, so much. Absolutely. It, it just blows my mind that they can still, like, develop and change their vo their voices even after all this time. And that's just what a fully, a fully fledged, you know, amazing vocalist is capable of and unreal. Um, but yeah, I've just taken it back slightly just so... There we go, just so I don't miss the second verse. Gosh, some men. Is that some men doing the ad libs as well? I assume so. Imagine like this being an opening, can't you? With all the visuals and stuff, like I can just imagine it. Oh, the chills are, the chills are back, my friends. The chills are back. Oh. so good and i think today as well the uh, making of that was released but there's no subtitles yet ah no subtitles which infuriates me because what i would have liked to have done is maybe have watched them at the same time i just want to see sungmin in the booth singing that so badly because like i said before the way he's using his voice and his his talent i just want to see it i want to see it on his face when he hits those notes as silly as that sounds but yeah perfect i bloody loved that i honestly think that sungmin has literally the perfect style the perfect sound just the perfect vocals for anything ost related i truly believe he can mold and change his voice to fit any sort of genre be it an anime be it a um a k-drama you know he just he just has a way with his voice and his talent to just adapt and it just sounds beautiful no matter what direction he goes. Like, it, he's absolutely phenom phenomenal, phenomenal <laughs> as, a, as a singer. And I'm, I'm so freaking proud of him. The fact that he is, is this his third or his fourth OST? That's amazing. Congratulations. And yesterday, he was at the Blumen. I don't know who, we, who they were against. Was it the LA Dodgers? God knows. But he did a pitch, finally, because last time it got cancelled, I think. Was it because of the weather or something? And did you see that throw? damn his leg was like 90 degrees did you see that my kid my kids my kings they're just living their best lives at the moment and it's it's unbelievable like i'm so proud i wake up and there's just something do that they're doing it's like i keep seeing the meme going around of like that one friend with loads of different jobs and it's just a, a skiz member just doing loads of different things it's like guys breathe you know i'm so happy for them they're just embracing every single day and why not we live once you know so i'm so freaking proud and that was wonderful. I love that song so much. Is it on Spotify? I wonder if I just search song. It is. That's perfect. I'm going to put that. Oh, there's an instrumental as well. I'm going to add that straight away to my Skiz playlist. Perfect. Because I love it. I love when I can just sit and listen to the songs. I just, it's, it's the best. Like what annoys me is that the Skiz records 
and not available on Spotify because I'm obsessed with the Love Me or Leave Me that, that Lino did, like obsessed with that. I listen to it like every day just to get me through the day. Why is it not on Spotify? <laughs> I know the day six version is, but why is Lino it's not? I need it. I need it like air. I need like oxygen to breathe. But anyway, yes. <laughs> so that was Sung Min with his OST with Phobia. Absolutely gorgeous. Like I say, there's just no doubting or denying their talent at all. Like I don't even have words anymore to like describe what they do you know i'm like the most boring reactor because i don't have like a reaction to them anymore because i'm just i have such high expectations i just know they're gonna nail it like i'm just not surprised anymore if that makes sense i'm just like yeah killed it nailed it beautiful next you know like what else am i meant to say absolutely stunning but anyway, yeah, thank you so much for tuning in, guys. Again, sorry, this is a little bit late. Um, just work has been kicking my backside at the moment. I've been so tired. Um, Hyunjin has also released two songs, which I'm going to be doing next as well. Can't wait to hear those. But yeah, regardless, when I upload these videos, thank you so much for clicking. Thank you so much for just being involved and still being here after all this time. Look after yourselves and I will see you very, very soon for some more Stray Kids. See you later. Thanks for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye. See you next time.